Olaf Compañeras, or is it Compañeras? I think it's Compañeras. Um, today, I step back from camera. So if you know me, you, and you all do, but if you know me very well, you know that I like to listen to this podcast called My Favourite Murder. Um, and the two women who do it came up last year with their dual memoir, and for ages I've put off buying it, but I thought to just treat myself during lockdown, and I finally got it! It's My Favourite Murder, and the title is Stay Sexy and Don't Get Murdered, because that's their, like, tagline for their podcast. And it's just all about their lives. I'm really excited to read it! It's like the highlight of my week, because it was just like one of those, like, um, uh, what's the word? I just didn't think about it. Impulsive, that's what it's called. Impulsive purchases. But I'm very excited. I'm going to start reading it right now. I'll let you know if it's a huge disappointment or amazing. I was going to buy the audiobook because they are podcast people, but it's not available in the country, so I'm going to have to just read myself, which is frankly just disappointing. But it's okay. I'll tell you if it's good or not. Bye. So I'm just going to try the challenge that Tylee posted in the Undatables chat uh, yesterday. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm using water because I don't want to use milk and then it will go over me and then it will go. Yeah, I won't be able to get it out because I've just washed this top. So I'm going to give it a go. Oh, <laughs> I swallowed it. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Tyler so much. This is all your fault. So me and my family went out for a little walk. We went to Blaze Castle. Got bloody lost. We did. We got really lost. We ended up on the local golf course. So now we're now we're here. We have no idea how to get back. We've asked like four different people how to get back to Blaze because we're like literally miles out. Don't know how we did it. We took one wrong turning and we went mm. so we're a bit lost. But it's kind of pretty. It's purple. I'll let you know. I'll keep you updated. Morning. Don't mind me, just moisturising my food. Ugh. Get the neck. I never moisturise my neck. Um. Ah. Uh, how are we? I've got my uh, active wear on in the hope that if I wear it, some activity will happen. Um, I'm actually wearing my... <laughs> these are my... Oh, that was like a workout, wasn't it? Um, these are my super camp shorts. And they're... Do you know what I'll show you? They're the ugliest fucking shorts. And look how big they are for me. So I have to roll them. But, um, uh, yeah, not much on the, not much on the menu today. Shalom, kids. Here I am, full face of makeup, all dressed up and nowhere to go. Joking. I am. Um, heading to Tesco, um, to do the weekly shop. And I was about to tell you something that might really annoy the other drivers, um, out there. I have had half a tank of petrol for 70 days and yet I am only now refilling it it's pretty impressive if I may say so myself I think that we're doing wonders for the pun out here always got to think about the positives but yeah that's what I'm gonna do um my mum's giving me a mask but I don't know whether to wear it or not um so let you know if I do. Wow, I've got the cosy on. Um, legs and all, which is quite a thing for me. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to get a tan, doing some reading. I've got 
in the smoothie oh my god i put carrot in it so it's carrot mango pineapple and apple mm. so fresh i'm kind of bored i'm not gonna lie i don't really know what to uh to do with myself <laughs> today i'm gonna do what i haven't done for quite a while and i'm very excited well i'm not that excited actually um there's a certain Lexi Wilkinson who once told me when I was feeling really down and I didn't know what to do with my life, which is what's happening now, don't know what to do, isolation, all that stuff. And she told me that I should write because I love it and I don't really do it that often, apart from for my degree. So that's what I'm doing today. I'm going to write some creative pieces and just see what comes out of it because I find it very therapeutic Hey quick, hey kids, I just wanted to quickly show you I'm in Tesco car park so people might think I'm really weird for recording but Jamie has a thing of recipes that you can get whilst walking around obviously single file because social distancing and it's got loads of different recipes and like healthy snacks to try so I can't wait to try that Fantastic. So I follow lots of food accounts, student food accounts, veggie food accounts, all that jazz. Um, and I found a recipe for sun-dried tomato and chickpea burgers or chickpea patties because they ain't burgers, let's be honest, let's be real. Um, I'm cooking them now and I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna end up, but I'm trying. We made it back to civilization. I say civilization. There's this. It's where my grandparents had their wedding reception in there, a bit boarded up at the moment. Um, oh my god, there's an ice cream van! Oh man, really want an ice cream. Oh my god, it's the ice cream van! Is he allowed to be working right now? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go and get my fucking ice cream. We got an ice cream. Got some ice creams. <laughs> I did get Liam one day because I didn't think I had enough money. So he's... Life is good. Now <laughs> going to get one. What's it like? Is it nice? Yeah, really nice. Mmm. Quid for that. Bloody brilliant, isn't it?